Kavanaugh with GayLifeNYC.org, and I'm here with two absolutely gorgeous men from Broadway Bears. Uh, what's your name? Adam Hart. And you are? Jeff Metzler. And thank you so much for being a part of this. So tell us why this organization is so important to you. Well, I've, I've known the Broadway Bears for like five years. Started when I was on tour doing Mamma Mia, and we collected every six months for Broadway Cares. And when I finally moved to this city, everyone talked about Broadway Bears and how much of a fun time it was and the community coming together. So I did it for the first time last year and just had a blast. So. It's so creative. Like, who comes up with these uh, different things? It's amazing. Well, you know, Jerry Mitchell originally started the show 20 years ago here at Splash. Um, and now each year there's a different kind of director. Last year was Peter Gregis, the year before was Dennis Jones, but they kind of have some creative... I think everyone kind of has, they have, I'm, I'm told, legend has it, yeah. there's a meeting, you know, I think as early back as December, I'm told, that they all put, a bunch of people put in ideas, you know, they keep telling us how they have idea upon idea every year to come up with, so they just kind of pick one that they feel they can build upon. Uh, that's the impression I'm given. What message do you have about uh, people getting tested and how important it is to be safe? You know, it's just, it's very important, not only for yourself, but just for the community at large. And I think that HIV and AIDS is one of the bigger obstacles that the gay community has been trying to overcome, especially nowadays when we're looking at gay marriage issues and all this and how the outside community views it. And so I think taking a lot of personal responsibility is important to, in demonstrating that, you know, everyone is deserving of everything in life and the same rights. And what is your message to people out there? Um, I think in particular for our generation, we never felt the direct effect of the AIDS epidemic when it first hit, when people knew of people that were uh, actually at my theater, we have a hairdresser who worked on the original Lukash Afa and told us uh, of stories of every week different people getting sick and going to funerals every week. We don't know that. We don't feel that, that direct effect of that fear and the horror that can have, you know, what the end result potentially could be. And so for our generation, you just have to, you have to do it. You just have to know that you have to be safe. You have to be step, uh, tested. You have to respect the people you're with as well as yourself. And you know, a test is j such a tiny thing that you know can have amazing benefits. I agree. And so, what are you guys doing right now? Are you guys in shows? Are you looking around? Um, right now, I'm in Mamma Mia here in New York, and and I uh, left the rooftops of London in October. <laughs> safe. Do you awesome. have any message out there for young people that might follow in your footsteps in, in this business? In this business and in this world these days, you know, I think you just really have to be smart, keep a clear head, and don't let temptation and you know spontaneity really get you. You know. Decisions, you know, there are consequences, and you know, you just I think you know, just really play it safe. Uh, don't always trust everybody, you know, and it's you know, the people that you do trust get tested and be safe. It's very important. That's good advice. So please listen. So Matt, what are you doing right now? Are you in a Broadway show or? I am currently not. Hopefully this fall. Um, but uh, I'm uh, just getting by in the city. All right, so all you casting directors that are friends of mine, here's Matt, and come on, give him a job. He's amazing. Pretty good. Thank, thank you so much, Matt. <laughs> thank you. Hi, I'm Jesse Archer. I'm here at Splash with Felicia Finley, who has been on Broadway. You wouldn't know it, but she's been on Broadway for 15 years. How are you doing? Uh, 15 years. I'm good. <laughs> You're looking good. We, we've been saying lately that Broadway's hard, boo. About it. This year's 20th anniversary theme is? Stripopoly. Yes, and it's based on that famous game show, Monopoly. And what peg are you going to be playing? Probably, um, I would say, one of the railroads. That's always a good buy. Okay, as long as you're, <laughs> it is a good buy. I know, and there's only four or two. Um, Better the electric company. <laughs> at least you're not the thimble. Oh, I know, the thimble. Know. Always, or, what did you pick? Um, uh, probably the high heel. I, I think it's the wrong game. My bad. <laughs> Have you seen like in the sh in the uh, solo strips? They'll do the the single for ten. They'll do they'll they'll do ones and they do the the one dollars and all that. It's hilarious. It's such a good time. I haven't seen that. The solo strips here at Splash, or they at the actual show at the very end. They have them there at at, okay. at both venues. At at um, well, it's going to be a bird. What is it? Birdland? No, no, no. Um, 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 Roseland. Roseland. Thank Something you. Something with a land. I love Birdland. <laughs> I love him too. Jim Caruso. Roseland on 52nd. Yeah. And they'll have the 
the strips there, and they'll have a strip once a month here every Sunday. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, April 11th is the next one. Okay. And it is the hottest show I have ever seen, and that yeah. includes everything I've seen on Broadway. Understatement of the year. I mean, the hottest buns. Yeah. Hot cross buns. Oh my my, et cetera, et cetera. And the sad thing is that we still have to have this because we still have the epidemic. Um, so hopefully yes. it'll be cured soon and we'll, we'll find another good reason to strip. Your mouth to anyone that's listening. Yes, I know. <laughs> Atheists unite. Did you have fun tonight? I certainly did. Thanks yes. so much, Felicia, for Thank being you, here. Thank you, Mr. Jesse. I appreciate it. Mwah. My pleasure. Best of luck on Broadway. Keep Thank doing you, it. Thank you, honey. I appreciate that. Absolutely. Our Broadway veteran, Felicia.